Alright, hi, I'm TM5650, Technical Manual, Central Boiler Plants, approved for public um, release, distribution, unlimited, headquarters, Department of Army, 1989. Um... Let's see here. Might not have been 98. 99. Section 4. Controls and instruments. Controls and instruments are an integral essential part of the all central boiler plans to serve as sure as economic reliable operation equipment that range from the simplest of the manual devices to complete automated and microprocessor based for control boilers, turbines, and the user energy. The subject of the controls and instruments are so intimately related that they, they are difficult to separate and discuss in, par in parallel for the in the following chapter. Only those systems and items which are commonly used in the central boiler plant are discussed. 220, um, 225. Feed water drum level control. The importance of adequate and properly controlled supply with the feed water boiler cannot be overemphasized. Boiler feed water pipe pumps and injectors. Paragraph 238 in Lower Lower water fuel cuts. Paragraph 227. The feed water heaters. Paragraph 237. Are all parts of effective feed water system. Steam boilers are required, uh, required drum level controls to maintain water level. The limits established by the manufacturer operating with the water levels that are too high may cause cover carry over to the, of the water from the drum. While operating the levels are too low, it can result in the boiler failures to do insufficient cooling. How feeder regulators are used adjacent to adjust feed water flow rate. Maintain proper levels. Feed, five types of feed water regulators are commonly po um, used. Positive displacement, thermo, hydraulic, thermostatic, pneumatic leveler, transmitter con controller, and a, um electronic level transmitter controller. Each of the described is below. A positive displacement type feed water regulator is connected with the boiler drum water column so the average water level in the chamber is in, in line with that of the drum. The rise of the fall of the flow to water level actuates balance feed valve through the suitable systems. The level reduces the increased flow of water to the boiler, the entire mechanism in the pressure space. There are no stuffing boxes to the lake or bind. The flow is intentionally charged with a small amount of alcohol with the vaporized pressure with the flow to the con counter um counter the act the um boiler pressure exerted on the outside of the flow the valve linkage is designed to gradually continuously change in water flow between high and low limits this type of control maintains a different water level for each of the system um flow produced by the boiler Thermohydraulic. Operation of a thermohydraulic vapor generator with a feed water regulator, figure 252, depends on the principle of the steam occupied with the greater volume of the water, which is formed. The equipment consists of the generator, diaphragm, operated valve, the necessary connection pipe, the, and tube. Central tube of the generator is connected with the boiler drum water column. The tube is inclined with the, so that the number of drum water level is slightly above the center of the generator. The generator tube and diaphragm chamfer are filled with hot water and operation heat from the steam. The upper portion of the inner tube raises the temperature of the water surrounding the portion of the tube converts it part into the steam. This increases the pressure of the generator, forces part of the water out of the generator until the water level is in the same, both inner and outer tubes. The water in which the water in which the feed out of the generator moves the diaphragm opens um, the valve. And uh, we'll start at the top of the page after we go over these drawings. Alright. This is a natural piping, um, gas pipeline, typical schematic arrangement, safety equipment, natural gas fired water, um, two boiler, uh, with one, one burner, ag, automatic recycling, automatic, and, um, non recycling controls. Figure 251 is a positive displacement feed water regulator. Figure 252 is a vapor generator, hot, the, um, hydro, hot, thermo hydraulic feed water regulator. When the water level in the boiler rises, some of the steam generator condenses is lower the pressure of the spring with the valve um, forces into the generator closing the valve process. Fin fl fins are installed with the, on the generator to radiate away some of the heat absorbed, the preventing the excessive pressure with the generator circuit and not increasing the speed reach. Bonds with the regularity of the type of the regularity establishes a relationship between water level of the drum and the valve opening. Therefore, each with the slow steam, um, stream of flow rate, the slightly different water level be, may, may be maintained. Thermostatic operation, metal thermostatic expansion type of the regulator, figure 253. 
three. Depends on expansion, contraction, and climb with the metal tube. The expansion tube is mounted on the steel frame in such a way that under con con um, tension and connected uh, to the same water. Space for the boiler so that it contains only the same when the water is at the lowest level of the table. Um, the tube expands with the minimum length of the water level of the boiler. It rises. The water also rises the tube, causing it to control and contract. The tube is connected with the balance valve and the feed water line system of the levers which move the valve as the tube length. The feed water valve is the maximum opening of the water level and is low, and the tube is filled with the filled with steam. Closes the water level and rises the tube shortened notes that all the above the regulators increase the flow of the water at level drops. Pneumatic transmitted controller. Uh, as boiler firing with the rates increased with the development of modern water for cold, cooled furnaces, the water storage capacity decreased. Feed water control became more difficult. A steam, a steam drum in a modern boiler can be empty with, a minute, with it water in minutes and if supplies uh, is shut off. Changes in the steam pressure result. Expansion of the swelling with the water to make sure and the falls of the water level indicates Applications. The mechanical controls discussed previously had have, have limited compatibilities to low response time. Pneumatic controls were developed to provide most accurate drum level control. Um, basic to all pneumatic systems, the drum level transmits the sensible level of manual automatic station on to allow the uh, manual control during stand startup. The control is determine the adjustment required of the feed water single and two and three element feed water control is available. One single element. Single element controls the use of the drum level transmitter manual automatic station control, sending the signal position to the feed water control valve. The controller can be adjusted to provide responsive, accurate control. Signal element control is adequate for the si system with gradual load changes. Two elements. Um, in two element controllers, both drum level and steam flows uh, levels is measured or used to control feed water because of the steam flow. It's measured with the control of the system can sense the response of the load changes because before they result in the drum level change of the system will compensate for the swelling and shrinking of the boiler and the drum uh, curve with the pressure changes during load swings. Two element control is recommended for the system and infrequent load changes. Three element. Three element control sends for the flow in addition with the drum level steam flow of the three element system that can compensate with the change of the feed water flow for the may occur with the feed water pressure of the temperature change feed water inaccuracy. This level of the control is not normally necessary except for the very large bowl. Boilers using system for large load changes on the boiler producing superheated system for the use of the turbine. See electronic transmitter control. One or two or three element feed water control systems are used available using electronic transmitters, manual automatic stations, and controllers. Electro-pneumatic actuators can be used for the final control device for the feed water control valve. An electro-pneumatic transducer is reduced required to convert the electrical signal into a pneumatic signal when pneumatic components. 226. Combustion controls. Combustion controls are adjust for the fuel and airflow that satisfy the boiler demand steam pressure, which change for the de and demand serves the input um, signal by the boiler firing range and is controlled. The high water boilers with the water temperature leaving the boiler is used for the input signal. Combustion control system, which maintains efficient fuel air ratio, the four of the boilers equipped with the induced draft fans. T tall stacks and the combustion controls also must be fan and in in inlet dampers of the boiler out dampers to control the furnace draft. The combustion control system, no matter how sophisticated, can do no do a better job of the controlling of the boiler than an operator. However, the combustion control system will operate continuous to make the necessary adjustments while an operator has other responsibilities to prevent this kind of attention. Combustion control systems compromised with the following general type of the components: sensing element, transmitters, controllers, indicators, actuators, control devices, control valves, and dampers. These components. Are, um, may be combined in the event endless variety of arrangements to provide almost any degree of sophistication required. Control concepts: one loop, closed loop control are used both in the boiler and boiler plant. On um, one loop um, control called the feed feed forward takes an input demand and generates single output response to the demand. The R253 shows the thermostatic metal expansion feed water. You have the gate valve, the boiler drum, the gate valve, the tension relief thermostat, um, dash water, um, boiler water, dotted nut water, boiler steam, and boiler feed water, ri rigid water um, lines. All right, your two element feed water controls. You have an or steam orifice boiler drum. Um, uh, high end wheel positioning relay feed line feed water regulator hand actuated sense selector valve position ag average relay air supply um, air supply air supply steam flow water level recorder and control pilots 
Result of the control and action is not considered closed loop, but the feedback control monitors the system variable that automatically generates the output of the adjusted system. The system remains out, out of balance control with the change, and you change the is output with the until the desired result the same with the signal. Well, the pneumatic actuator on the valve is an example of the open loop with the control of the reference figure 255 with the actuator received the signal generated from the output. The movement of its shaft, the same pneumatic actuator can be converted with the closed loop control by equipping it in with the positioner. The auto actuator receiving the signal generates output with the motion move of the shaft. The shaft is in position is me measured by as feedback. If the shaft is not used, not in desired position, the output of the positioner is um, automatically readjusted. The shaft is moved again until the correct position. The basic advantage for the closed loop control is that it provides more accuracy adjustment due to the ability to overcome high hysterosisly losses, high hysteria losses caused by the friction and linkage of the valve, the actuator, mechanical items, the effect of hysterious hysterious is the cause of valve mechanical stop to stop at a uh, slightly different adjustment each time typical open loop control may be able to control the position to with um who with um plus or minus five percent of the desired rating whereas to closed loop um, control can typically control approximately plus or minus one percent closed loop control is available um is in one or two, three modes, controlling portional integral res directive, um, derivative, and response. The different responses are discussed below. Our proportional control is also called gain control, the simplest form of the closed loop control with the proportional and proportional control of the um, um, difference between the set point of the set system variable with the measure of the corrective action is taken and adjusting the control output. The proportional steam pressure control is illustrated in figure 257. Steam pressure set up at the set point, actual steam pressure or compared output is generated with the portion of the difference. Figure 258 illustrates proportional control of the portional gains um, setting of the five of the fuel value open to five percent or each one percent joint drop in um, steam pressure for the proper gain and simple gain is defined in the control output change with the percent divided in the system change and the uh, variable change in percentage. Gain is equal to change, change of the control percentage over change of um, system variable. Proportional band inverse gain with expanded in percent in proportion equals 1 over 1 over the gain times 100 divided equals the change in system variable percent over um, change in per control output times 100. The gain of 5 equal equivalent proportional band of the 20 20 figure 259 illustrates the response to the steam pressure control system in the change with the steam flow note that the offset dead band difference between the set point and the steam pressure the following observation should be noted about the proportional control a proportional control operates and establish steady state portion um, positions because of the different exists exists between the set point and system variable in the expense figure 258 and uh, only the 50 percent of the fuel valve of position would be steam pressure exactly match the set point at all the fuel valve positions the difference of up to 10 psi from the set point would be required to maintain fuel valve position and would satisfy the steam flow demand. Be the larger and gainer the smaller proportional band with the controller and the greater with the response with the controller change with the system variable, the smaller the dead band. See the smaller the gain, the larger the proportional band, and the smaller the response and change with the system variable, the larger the dead band. A large gain may be not stable. The fuel valve cycling between fuel and open, full open and full close is an example of unstable operation. Integral. Integral, also called reset control, was developed and improved the accuracy of proportional control. Integral action works to eliminate the dead band, which is inherent with the proportional control. Integral control adjusts the control output sets based upon the offset with the time offset existed. Adjusting continues with the set point with the system variable with the same time of the maximum hour minimum output is reached. Figure 260 illustrates proportional plus integral control response to change the steam flow proportional plus integral control is called two mode control reducing integral time um, increase the integral control response when increasing the integral time reduces the control response Our right, derivative is a mathematical term considered with the rate of the train system. Um, some of the system derivative of the rate respond for the improve the speed accuracy with the control anticipating trend before the actual change of the curves proportional plus integral play. The derivative control is called three mode of the control and is rarely used for the same heating plant. It can be used in effect with the hot water plant with the recognized change of the direction system variable for the example the boiler output water temperature starts with the fail. Um, fall after having been re risen at the fuel valve that should be open with the supply to satisfy the new demand of the hot water even though the set point may not be even reached yet. Reducing the derivative of time increasing the derivative of control response with the increasing derivative of time depressed the response. Too much the derivative of control can be dampened in other, other control responses. Pneumatic control basis. Basics. Basic pneumatic control is shown in figure 261. Controllers consist of five
Five basic components listed below. Measuring element, flapper, nozzle, venting, orifice, restrictive input, orifice, chamber between orifice. Alright. Figure 225 shows the control valve with a pneumatic actuator. Alright, figure 256 shows the control valve with a pneumatic um, actuator and positioner. Figure 257 shows the steam pressure control system um, from the system, fuel valve, boiler, steam pressure, steam pressure sensor, um, steam pressure set points, A and controller, A and C, error, A and K error, back to the system fuel valve. The triangle stands for deviation from control variable set point, K stands for um, proportional action. 258 shows proportional control with the um, steam pressure and PSI with the, fuel, with the percentage fuel opening on the error signal. Of um, 110, 110 to 90 psi, and uh, error signal of 10 negative psi to negative 10 psi. 259 proportional response: low steam um, flow, proportional gain of five set point offset pressure valve, fuel valve position time, fuel, um, load steam flow, proportional gain of 10 set point offset pressure valve position. 260 proportional plus integral response: load set point pressure valve opening time. The flapper is situated so that it can shut off the throttle with the flow of the air when the nozzle orifice is moved with the sensing of the element response to the change of the control valve of the flapper and the venting orifices are also considered one unit called the vent valve with the instrumental quality air and supply with the control through the input orifice is dependent with the atmosphere through the venting orifice. As long as the flapper is positioned away from the orifice, the venting orifice is larger than the input orifice, therefore the flapper restricts the flow of the air pressure into the chamber to control of the air pressure to the final control drive position for the increase in most clearance between the flapper and the nozzle control the air pressure fed into the, um, to the control drive. The measuring elements control the flapper nozzle the clearance and the indicated by the, by the pressure temperature flow level and being controlled with this fundamental control rather than limited um, capability and if you must be situated close to the device um, uh, close to the device I lost my spot the measuring element controls the flapper nozzle clearance dedicated, dictated by the te and temperature pre and fluid level to be in control with the fundamental controller is for the rather limited capability. If used in situated clothes, the device it controls it must accurately current require a small volume of the air must control the process. Requires only limited control range, one mode controller with a proportional band determined with the position of pivot piping, pivot point, venting orifice of measuring element, two mode, three mode controllers developed by using additional measure elements, flappers, orifice chambers, adjusting mechanisms, and spring the basic controller is flexible and is equipped with a power volume power or volume booster relay the typical two um, diaphragm bo bo booster relay is shown in figure 262 the ratio of two different diagrams areas are maybe varied in two the desired input and output ratio the relative the three to one diaphragm ratio will give the three psi chain for the control air output signal either each one psi change in chamber a depending on the ratio of the diaphragm air the type of the relay may be used to increase either the volume of the control air pressure at the drive and control the, from control from the chamber with the acting with the diaphragm in chamber a cause the diaphragm a and b to move downward opening the valve two which emits the chamber d to chamber c the force exerted with the control air with the chamber c equals the force in chamber a the downward movement of the diaphragm assembly ceases with the control air put output pressure and control devices which remain constant which pressure in chamber a decrease of the diaphragm assembly will move upward valve the two loose um and valve one open with the valve into and air and um out of the chamber c but the atmosphere through, through chamber b the decrease in control air pressure to the control device. All right, see the control of stroker and fire boilers. Um, combustion control of the stroker fire boilers must have the ability to adjust the fuel air ratio, compensate for the change for the cool heating of the valve, moisture bed, um, bed thickness, force draft, and, fan, and preference the ambient, ambient air cha um, change of the speed and spread of strokers with their sperm with the proportion of cold and suspension react differently. Then underfade with the traveling cha chain with the vibrating stroke with the spreader stroke with the responding best for the change in fuel feed rate. While the gas burning strokes respond will change in the air flow rates. The two types of the control pull, parallel position control, and series par parallel control are commonly used with the strokers. One parallel position control figure 263 illustrates the parallel position control system deviation system with the pressure set point result with the master control signal um, signaling for the fuel actuator to combust in over fire uh, 
air actuators to respond, reposition themselves in the higher fire rating. Two fuel air ratio control standing lever provided to allow the operator to adjust the trim combustion overflow, over fire air supply. The furnace pressure control with the monitors for the furnace pressure. Adjust the ID fan inlet damper to maintain the slight negative pressure in the furnace manual automatic station and provided with the allow the manual control. Two series and parallel control. The figure 264 illustrates series parallel um, system. In this system, system pressure is controlled um, to the fuel feed um, rate, steam flow with the control airflow rate, with the combining a combination of the airflow with the steam flow meter was described and discussed in paragraph 228. Operators use the type of the meter of the guide with the control with the relationship between the air required to burn and the fuel and the air actually supplied. The steam generation rates is used to measure the air required and um, the flow gas through the boiler setting and used to measure the air supply with the bearing by comparing the two and checking on the air with the fuel ratio of the furnace to be obtained with the type of the one meter um, that has been for many years and the commonly called the boiler meter the series parallel with the control combines position control with the fuel with the meter and c control with the airflow and initial calibration represents the airflow signal with the very important over fire air fans that are modulated with the boiler load, but they're obtaining the best combustion result with the lowest possible excess for the air levels, although the feature has not been shown in Figure 264 is provided with the main application. D control the oil and gas fire boilers, parallel position, parallel meeting, or type of the combustion controls are available. Oil gas fire boilers, either type may be equipped with the trimming control with the adjusted fuel air ratio. Based on the oxygen level, the flow gas, the pneumatic, electrical, electronic, computer, computer operator, the controls are available. Parallel position can control in which compound packs, modern air, oil, and gas pump burning packages is possible. The use of the single jack sheet, shaft levers to control both the fuel and air. Two figure 265 is and illustrates the typical jack shaft. Our figure 261 shows the basic pneumatic controls, a moving by the measurement element, a pivot, a flapper, the moving nozzle and venting orifice, the two controls drive, the chamber, the input orifice, the instrument of air input. Our right, pneumatic boiler, boy, 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 booster relay um, goes through instrument air input, the valve A, valve 2 to chamber D, um, D valve 1 to chamber C. Um, and then chamber B to bleed the atmosphere, and also through um, air control, air control to the chamber A, diaphragm A. All right, M, M slash A stands for manual, manual automatic. This is a parallel position control system. The steam header goes into the furnace collection boiler. The furnace um, from the furnace connection boiler it goes into the pressure control and ID fan inlet damper. Your original um, from the furnace connection and the steam header goes to the master control to other boilers, sub master ma manual automatic stations, which run to ma ma manual automatic stations, um, fuel air ratio manual automated stations, fuel air ratio manual automated stations. Well, the manual automated station fuel actuator, ma fuel air ratio manual automatic station combined actuator, air actuator, and over fire air actuator. The master regulator is proportional control with the sense of the steam pressure generated the rot rotary output, which moves the, the jack shaft adjustable the valve. The use the control to characterize this to characterize the fuel and oil gas flows. These flow uh, together use the mechanical linkage that connects the um, them to the FD damper to establish the fuel ratio. The system is effective. The fuel air conditions remain constant, but the linkage and tight accurate adjusted some parallel um, positioning control system replacing the jack shaft using an automatically electronically generated fuel air ratio and individual actuators. For each of the vo fuel valve and the fan damper, the approach which is illustrated in Figure 263, it can be more accurately, more easily adjusted and trim position controls to the typing system. So, also assumes the fuel and airflow also weighs change the same amount of the e each change of the valve of the damper position, the open loop of the control system. Two parallel metering control. Then the fuel airflow with the burner meter meter the control can be used with it, which receive feedback from the metering metering device. Further adjust the fuel air rate actuator. They enable ensure the when the specific flow and the airflow is demanded. They actually deliver to the fire that becomes the closed loop of the closed system and known as the parallel metering control. The parallel meeting system illustrated in Figure 266 TM858102. High temperature watering ta heating system requires metering control for the hot water boilers. Capacity grade than 20 million BTUs per hour. The type of the system is commonly used in large size of steam boilers. 
Oxygen trim control. Um, one of the most modern oil gas fired boilers is um, well made. Was it was many coal fired units. Oxygen analyzers use the combustion kinds for the operators. Oxygen content for fuel gas verifies the proper fuel air ratio. The control system has been developed to allow automatic adjustment of the fuel air ratio based on the reading of the oxygen and analyzer. These systems are called oxygen trim control. The figure two six seven illustrates the typical oxygen trim control. Although the more arrangement also available, the controls are not applicable to all systems because of the trim adjustment are small in accuracy with an actuator plus or minus 5%. The trim required is 2% oxygen trim will not be effective. The following conditions must exist before an oxygen can be effective added to the boiler. All right, air, air inflation, inflation, uh, infl air inflation, inflation, inflation of the boiler must be minimal with the science of the trim controller, but there can be distinguished between the air and be may enter through the burner inflation air. The flame can be started from the air at the burner and produce smoke, which um, will still register access to the air and uh, analyzer trim control. It also becomes unstable leakage rate with the change of the combustion equipment. Must be capable of operation new fuel or air ratio that can be tested manually. A burner cannot be expected to operate automatically at low oxygen levels if it cannot do so. Manually, the existing com um, combustion control components must be able to uh, operate accurately. Oxygen trim can be expected to compound um, defic deficiencies in existing systems. 227 Boiler Safety Control. Boilers are equipped with a safety device to minimize the risk of low water expansion related damage. Figures 248 through 250 illustrate the typical safety system. The typical um, oil to gas fired boiler safety control system includes the following components low water fuel cutoff switch, high steam pressure, high water temperature switch, flame scanner. Gas supply high pressure switch, gas supply low pressure switch, combustion airflow switch, purge airflow switch, fuel safety shutoff valves with closed position switches, fuel control valves with lower fire position switches, manual valves, cocks and strainers and traps, atomizing steam air switches, atomizing steam air shutoff control valves, low oil pressure switch, high furnace pressure switch for boilers introduced with the draft fans, fan motor switch, and control logic. National Fire Protection Association standards 85A, the single burner system, 85B for the multiple burner gas fired systems, 85D for multiple burners, oil fired systems. Establish rules for operation with equipment listed above. Note on some of the more important items given below the control logic. Control logic provides the following action. Pre purging um, pre purging the boiler below the light off proper operation limits and interlocks. Lower fire start with the release of the modulation sequence trailer of the igniter flame sequence. So the igniter is shut off at the end of the trail main flame. Trailer with the main flame ignition system. Main flame and the normal operation. Safe shutdown system boiler but post purge. Electronic controls are available with the receive the flame scanner signals provided with the control sequence listed above with the connected into the proper switches, valves, and motor stackers starters. Um, the electronic controls are equipped with the self tracking circuits with um, provided with the controls of operation figure 628 show the electronic programming um, control incorporated in the simple control cabinet typically on the fire tube boiler application note that the motor starts. Figure 264 shows a uh, steam going into the airflow transmitter, um, steam pressure transmitter, steam flow transmitter, the S and F. Um, uh, Re the proportional plus reset, um, proportional plus reset, master hand auto selector to other boilers, stroke and hand auto selector to the force draft hand uh, draft uh, hand auto um, selector from the proportional plus reset actuator sec um, action and stroker feet hand auto selector to the force hand draft hand automated selector stroke and feed to um, control the valve the FTV van. Force draft um, damper control drive, upper draft damper control drive, airflow sections, coal and furnace draft connection, boiler, furnace draft control, uh, reset action, uptake draft handle, uh, action selector, and uptake draft. All right, your jacket shaft control system, um, manual automatic station master, master regulator, steam pressure jack shaft, fuel oil valve, gas valve fan. Alright, MA stands for manual automatic steam header from the boiler furnace connection, the um furnace connection board, the boiler furnace pressure controller, ID fan inlet damper accurate, and then it also goes for the furnace connection boiler, steam header mass controls, the other boilers, submaster manual automatic fuel air ratio, 
um, which has a fuel control master a a um, action station, fuel actuator, fuel transfer transmitter, fuel butterfly valve in the meter, and the fuel air ratio from the submaster ma main automatic stations, fuel air ratio, air control master, automatic station, air actuator, air transmitter, and air. Parallel metering system. 267 trim control system. Um, starting with the air trim control, the oxygen analysis, it was a O2 probe um, sent with the um, oil supply down the, the um, gateway to the um, differential control valve, adjusting orifice oil control valve, oil valve, oil return, re re return solenoid to the air trim connector. Um, trim controller, the air trim control controller, the adjustment set, with set, set and point switch assembly to the primary jack shaft burner and pressure signal steam header on the far side of the air trimmer you go, um, air trimmer controller you have the secondary jack shaft burner mounted fourth draft fan wind boxer zero o2 trim control register burner burner automatic register low low louver control master pressure control power unit All right, control and the draft indicator are included. Relay logic has been commonly used for the path of multiple burner applications, but is in like with the new feature. Many of the new systems will be operated, monitored, and probable programmable controllers. Low for water fuel and cutoff with low magnet type. Is electro electro type of the low water fuel cutoff devices commonly used to refer to figure 269 270 for the purpose of the eliminate the major cause of the boiler fire failure firing a boiler with low water level in such a condition exists the limit of the trigger that is open the fuel up to the boiler is shut off because of the importance of low um, water fuel cutoff the device it requires manual reset the electrical type of low water fuel cutoff that uses probes electrodes to sense the water level the water level is above the low water electrode electricity conduct with the ground sound sound string relay control coil and Energized and other relays used to provide manual re reset feature required. Monetary electrical circuits can be provided with the bypass flow water fuel cutoffs to allow the blowdown equipment for the disruption and normal operation. See pressure temperature switch. A variety of different types of the pressure switches are required to measure the wide range of the pressure between the and present in the bore. The pressures range from the few inches of the water in the furnace to hundreds of pounds per square inch in the steam drum. Figures 271 illustrate the Borden type. Warden tube type pressure element for the mercury filled with the typically for the application of ranging five to a few hundred psi. The diaphragm type of the mechanism snap action switches are shown in figure 272. Are you with the air pressure measurement in inches of the water range? In both cases, change in the system pressure can as the sensing elements deflect the activation and activating switch mechanism temperature switch can be used. Liquid vapor filled with um, bulbs, biomedical bio elements, active, active cylinder, cylinder switches um, shown. Yeah, reference figure 273. Flame scanners which view the ultraviolet range of the lights commonly called um, UV scanners. That's all five type of the scanners which may which view the infra infrared visible um, range of the light. Also common self-checking scanners like the UV scanners are shown in figure 274 equipped with the shutter that allow the scanners electronically controlled to prove all the, that all the scanners components are properly functioning. New type of system scanners electronically are also available to measure frequency of the light observed in the account of that for the fact that the base of the flame um, generates light with frequency of any 100 cycles per second will the tips generate light less than 60 cycles per second. The frequency scanners are especially effective with multiple burner applications because they discriminate well between the flames and the various burners. And, and you and, and you say, Annucators. An initial type of the annucator system. Annucators are frequently used um, in boiler plants to perform following the function, following functions. Provide continuous monitoring of the important operating of conditions such as temperature, pressure, level, vibration, main flame, bearing cool, other conditions associated with the boiler safety control plant system. Also, all, all alert operator for the off and normal conditions require the operator acknowledgement of off normal conditions advise the operator with the condition require return to normal. 228 additional controls and instrument. There are many types of controls and instruments that are applied with the army boiler plant. Some of them provide with the measurement functions, while others provided with both in measurement and control. Some of the common types of the instruments and measures of the controller are discussed below. Airflow system flow, flow meter. The airflow system flow meter, which is commonly called the boiler meter, is typically added with a series pair with the combustion control system that provides the operator with a guide with the control with the relationship between the air required to efficiently burn with the fuel of the air actually supplied. 
The typical airflow steam flow um, meter is shown in figure 276 of the application discussed in paragraph 276. The essential part of the meter is the air to flow air to airflow bell um, bell supported by the knife edge on the beam with which is supported by the other knife edge is mercury displacer assembly also supported by the knife edge on the beam. The bottom of the bells are sealed with the oil space of the, um, under the bells and connected with the two points for the boiler setting. The boiler, point of the higher draft is connected with the left hand point bell with the pointer of the lower draft with the right hand bell. The arrangement is similar to the out of the of that of the flow meter because of the consistent device measuring the pressure of the different draft differential the flow of the gas and through the boiler setting the flow to the small the law, law as steam of the water flowing through the orifice measure of the differential or the head causing the flow of the proportional square velocity. Um, the flow of the meter is constructed by the movement of, of the pen and the chart is directly proportional to velocity. Therefore, if the airflow is in this flow of the movement of the steam flow of the pen, the airflow mechanism is compensated so that the movement is directly proportional to the flow of steam when the proper airflow of the ratio is being supplied. The compensation accomplished for the airflow display, so displacer is a bar, bar, Parabolic, parabolic float. Enough weight is placed on the system to cause the displacer submerged with the mercury. There is no pressure differential on the bells. As the gas flows through the boiler, increase the right of the end of the air moves up the effective weight of the displacer, increase the reduced amount of the beam movement in the turn. A figure 268 shows the electrical programming controller bo um, boiler panel. Figure 269 shows the float management. Um, your low, low, low cutoff point, your rising level, um, pivot return spring, falling, rising level, falling level. A permanent magnet is attached with a pivoted mercury between um, two, uh, one and two. As the float um, three rises with the water level, it marries the management magnet actuator. Four into the field magnet with the two magnet against the new non-magnetic barrier. Two five two, type of the tighting. Tilting the mercury switch, the barrier two provides a static seal beyond between the um, switch mechanism and the flow, eliminating the need for flexible bellow seals, packaging glands, or other failure-prone setting links elements. When the water level falls, such that the wa lower water condition with the float draws the magnetic actuator below the magnetic field, the magnetic swings in out and tilts with the mercury switch to the, to the reverse person, actuating the low water alarm and operator in the burner cutout circuit. 270 electro type electro type low water fuel cutoff. 271 the board on type tube pressure um, switch a burn on tube calibrated dial set point indicator. Figure 272 diaphragm pressure switch. So you set adjustment screw, and then from the right down um, low pressure connection one eighth of an NPT high pressure connection one eighth of an NPT adjustment range of spring screws type electrical terminals SPD. SPDT snap switch diaphragm with support plate as your diaphragm pressure switch and number figure 2273 shows the temperature switch. Figure 274 shows the U fl V flame scanner, um, flame being monitored, shutter scanner, UV detector, amplifier, sh shutter driving circuit, flame master control, and, and fuel valve. Um, self checking control, the energizer flame relay, one and electrical component fails, two flame signal is absent and continuous for any other reason. 275 is an annuous initiator. 276 is the airflow steam um, steam meter, steam flow pen, airflow pen, pressuring type um, type bearing, guide link, leadus bell, mercury, um, low pressure connection, high pressure connection. The amount of thin arm movement during um, during the initial start of the mechanism adjust for the steam flow airflow pen record together with the correct airflow ratio with being maintained during the operation the airflow pen required records higher the on the chart with the steam flow pen with the operator with indicating the too much for the air is being supplied with the vice versa. Temperature control. The direct action of the pilot operator pneumatic electronic te temperature controls are available. The direct action acting temperatures control regulators are shown in figure 277. Consistent of bells operative with the valve directly connected with the capillary tube with the temperature bulb. The bells of the capillary bulb system are filled with the liquid gas and liquid vapor combination. The bulb is inserted whenever the temperature is controlled. The feed is the feed water with the, um, the heater or hot water heater of the valve of the line within the steam water hot water line supplying the te heat. The temperature change with the bulb produces the expansion of the control. 
contraction of the bell of the support. So we can movement of the valve stem and adjustable compression spring that go open the post the expansion of the bell is provided by the means of adjusting the control temps to direct actuating regulators. While simple, uh, simply reliable and expansive limited capacity of the valve of the bulb must be located within the practical length of the pulmonary um, capillary. One pilot operated valve. The pilot operated valves are available with large capacity. The more flexible with the insulation pilot operated valves may be operated with either internal or external pilot valve of the bulb and capillary system control of the movement of the small pilot valve with the variable load pressure producing the pilot valve control the tech um the the movement of the control valve the two seventy eight with the show of the pilot operated tem um control tem valve the directing acting uh and pilot operated temperature regulators as proportional device. Pneumatic electronically temperature control for improved uh, control accuracy to mode proportional plus integral temperature controls are available using either pneumatic electronic control for the field with the bulbs, bimetal with the elements, thermocoupled to resistant temperature devices, or RTDs are used the sensing elements. The pneumatic electronic controls are compared with the sensor temperature and the, with the senate point and generate output with the control of the actuator valve. The actuator may either be pneumatic or electronic. Fis pressure controls. Pressure controls are made divided into two general system t general types, one type of the measure for set pressure one part of the system with it while the pressures in other parts of fluctuates change within certain limits an example of this type of the control is pressure reducing valve which maintains a set pressure for the discharge side of the controlling flow system or air or gas the second type of the controller maintains a constant pressure differential between two points and all color controls and flow of the type of the control is often Applied to the boiler feed water system with the maintain of the fixed differential between the pressure of the water supply with the feed valve the pressure and steam drum of the pressure control may consist of either self contained devices which operate with the regulating valve directly with the pressure measurement device that, such as a bodon bordon tube that which operates to medically control the control position of the regulating valve or mecha mechanism maintain the desired condition um, operating with the pressure reducing differential pressure valve de um, depends upon the load applied with the diaphragm piston balancing the force exerted with the tube by a spring the pressure load is applied with the both side of the diaphragm piston differential pressure valve but only one side of the pressure reducing valve the spring weight is used to balance the valve in either case Are your pilot operated pressure reducing valve? The valve shown in figure 279 is self-contained pressure reducing valve, which operates its valve to deliver pressure of the axle upon the bottom of the diaphragm, tending to push it up. The movement is then opened by the spring. The diaphragm assumes the position develop dependent upon those two factors. The pilot valve is then held against the diaphragm of the spring so that any movement of the diaphragm causes the pilot valve to move. One side of the pilot valve is connected with the fuel pressure on any other um, type of the top of the piston, which is the contact with the main valve of the spring at the bottom. The main valve holds with the valve against the piston. The supply of the force necessary to move the piston up when the valve is at equilibrium. This will flow through the sufficient maintain the different discharge pressure. The desired level is in any drop of the pressure of the discharge side and cause the spring to push the depth down and open the pilot valve further. Pilot valve in turn transmit the pressure to the chamber above the piston and cause the piston to move down where they open to the main valve, then increase the flow to prop building up the discharge pressure for the valve to open once again with the e again equilibrium. The ve um, reserve backward uh, curve of the discharge pressure release rises. The discharge pressure set point is regulated by the adjusting spring. Or your diaphragm pressure reducing valve. The valve is a figure 280 with the equipment of the diaphragm actuator that is used for the many purposes commonly agonized with the pneumatic control. Serve so the pneumatic control valve when used for the pressure reducing valve, the pressure of the control, but they apply with the top chamber the movement of the 10 diaphragm. The diaphragm is transmitted directly to the control valve and the uh, valve is increased with the pressure push of the diaphragm out of against the resistance the spread closes the valve. Equilibrium established the control pressure can be varied with adjusting compression in the spring. Figures 281 illustrate the self-contained diaphragm pressure is reducing valve. The outlet pressure balances the force of the spring within the valve with the remote pressure sensing capability. Figure 277, the direct, action te uh, direct acting temperature, vapor pressure type, hot to uh, chamber type. Two seventy eight pilot operated temperature control valve sensing element pilot's diaphragm steam in steam out CD seat ring two seventy nine pilot operated pressure reducing valve low sensing diaphragm adjusting spring upper sensing diaphragm pilot valve main diaphragm seat ring main valve diaphragm actuator pressure reducing Diaphragm control pressure connection, diaphragm casting, t top work spring, adjusting screw, yoke, body head, inner valve, and blind flange. Self-contained diaphragm pressure reducing valve, adjusting screw, adjusting spring, diaphragm output, input.
Over the previous valve, the lemonade with the simplicity of the valve differential pressure reducing valve within the valve shown in figure 282 of the pressure tight chamber that provided on each valve of the diaphragm and the spring U with the control of the differential between the two pressures at the top of the bottom chamber that connect with the two pressures that we control when the force of the top chamber of the diaphragm is equal to the force of the bottom plus for the swing force so the valve is said to be in equilibrium. If the bottom chamber of the pressure chamber with the spring acts uh, on the diaphragm to cause the pressure and vary simultaneously maintain a constant differential steam differential pressure reducing valves. Figure 283 illustrates the differential pressure reducing valve typically you put the control atomizing steam the oil burns the oil sensing line with the connect of the top chamber of the valve pressure oil spring with the atoms together with the balance pressure of the steam adjusting the valve of the position force applied with the spring establish the difference pressure between the oil steam the flow meters five types of flowing measure measuring elements typical um, found with the central heating plant the differential pressure variable the area of the voltmetric positive displacement propeller and turbine weirs and flumes um, the measuring elements would be contained with the recorder that indicate the total lights to provide information of the plant operation. Differential pressure meter, uh, meters. The differential pressure flow meters measure the pressure of the located loss created with the flow um, fluid flow through the pipeline restriction limit, such as an orifice flow nozzle of the venture. The water, figure, reference figure 284 water seam, then glass flowing through the restriction increase with the velocity decrease and the pressure of the pressure drops increase by a square flow of the velocity. Thus, in an orifice, the pressure drops 100, in, 100 inches of the water, the 100% flow. The pressure drop only one inch of the one water, the 10% flow. This explains why it's difficult to differential, differential flow meter to provide accurate information for the low flow rates. Figure 285 illustrates the team um, flow recorded required by the Lex, the Lex ball. Lex bell is, sorry, the Lex bell. The Lex bell is shaped to take the square root of the signal from the line restricts the movement of the button bell is transmitted through the system of lever linking with the pen with the record of the flow of the chart. The pneumatic transistor is like one of the shown figure 286 available to replace the um, function of the Ludex bell, the very accurate electronic transmitters are also available. Two variable area meters. A variable area me, um, rotometer is shown in figure 287. The, the type of the meter is the fluid uh, passes upward through the tapered meter tube, which contains. Um, Flow, the flow position indicates the rate of the fluid flow of the voltmeter. The voltmeter is the voltmeter is the displacement of the meters are frequently used to measure the gas flow of water with the equipment of the dial or register to indicate the total volume of the flow. The figure 288 illustrates the positive displacement type of the meter of the oil surface. The meters can also be equipped to generate the flow of the rate signal for turbine meters. If in, in this, in these types, in this, in these turbine type meters, ro rotational velocity of the propeller turbine with the proportional to the fluid velocity of the flow. <laughs> Flow of ratio, rates are measured with electronic equipment with sense of the ratio. Rotational velocity converts with the volumetric reading with figure 289 illustrates the turbine meter. Weirs and fumes change the liquid flow rate through the weir of the flume, which got, um, caused the change in the upstream of the liquid flu level. The flu uh, flow actuated level indicators are used to indicate the flow rate. Pressure gauge. A number of devices may be used to measure the pressure of the burdon tube, may be in one of the most commonly applied boiler plants. One burden tube pressure gauge. The measuring the elements of burden tube gauge of the figure 290 of the tube overall cross section bent with the arc with this closed with the one on one end connected with the source of pressure at the other end. Um, the oval cross section change within the shape of the change of the pressure when the pressure change within the tube increases the cross section tends to become circular called the tube the straight and the movement of the free end of the burden bird on tube is transmitted through the gear set. Um, gear sector and pinion to point the um, pointer indicate the change of the pressure. The exact shape of the tube, the material from which it is dependent upon the pressure range from which the gauge is to be used. The type of the gauge can be used to measure the pressure either above or below the atmospheric. When using the gauge to measure the steam pressure, the siphon water leg must be used to ensure the hot steam does not come in direct contact with the tube. Other type of the, um, pressure gauge, the diaphragm type of the gauges are measured from the small differential to, um, in inches of wa water with, when a tool, total pressure does not exceed 1 psi gauge. The high static pressure for the output of the bellow gauge of the figure 291 are available to read or read a wide range of differential pressure with a suitable reading of the fluid pressure. Drop through the boiler circuit can be used to measure the differential from 2 to 1,000 psi at a pressure of 6,000 psi gauge. For above the range of this Army Central Boiler Plant must be a sophisticated device measurement of the pressure differential pressure and also a market the general described the transducer there are based on the variety of the principles some examples of the transducer using strain J gauge mounted with the diaphragm that O's using the crystal when it's ever to go with the change electrical resistance of the element is to form such since such elements require all right figure 282 shows the reducing figure differential pressure reducing valve 
Figure 283 shows the steam pressure reducing valve, adjust for screw oil sensing connector steam in and steam out. Are your orifice plate venera, vena contract taps? Um, vena contract contracts orifice plate mercury ma manometer differential pressure flow nozzle differential pressure micro, make mercury mono nozzle French tube site flow throat differential pressure my, mercury manometer eighty four two eighty four is the orifice flow nozzle inventories. Or your steam flow rec recorder, um, figure 285, steam flow pan, pressure type bearing, spindle, flow pressure connection, fork, lever, high pressure connection, Lytx bell, mercury, guide link. 286, pneumatic differential, orifice flow and re recording integral in integrations, um, A, differential diaphragm, B, length, B, C, floating, pivot, D, linkage, feed, C, feedback diaphragm, F, zero springs, G, baffles, H, pivot, and I, nozzle, J, reversing relay. Outlet and inlet ro rotary meter. On the screen, registry, register, um, n no, notating disc. Turbine meter, enlarge view, um, view of the turbine. Figure 290, burden type pressure gauge. The upper dial screw, uh, dial screw, lower dial screw, dial, and then dial pin, process connection, process connection, socket, socket screws, hairspring, movement, so slide, screws, move, connection links, movement, connection link, tip, pointer, burden tube, movement, holding screw, and case. Figure 291, up above bellows differential pressure gauge. In the indication bellows rate, rain springs indicated to um, drive in internal in in for indicator in recorder spring retainer input and output. Elaborate frequent calibration. There are not historically been used for the base uh, instrument, Iomi um, central boiling plants. However, the rapidly increase with the reliability, easy application produced the transducer. Finding wi wider application will become more frequent seen. Um, draft gauge. The draft gauge is formerly pressure gauge with the measure of the pressure of the range, instance of the water with the column. Draft gauge typically are used to measure air pressure for the furnace, wind box, and boiler output and outlet, including the U-tube manometer, the diaphragm type of the draft with the gu gauges are common. Manometers. Figure 9 292 show the Included the incline with the U tube manner with the inclined manometer, specifically for the inclined leg with the reserve fill with the gauge oil with the typically inclined with the manometer. With the length of the scales is 12 inches for each one inch of the water draft. The measure is important that the use of the gauge oil will extend the manometer was designed to obtain accurate reading since the gauge reading is dependent on the density of the oil. The information is normally stamped on the manometer. Um, diaphragm draft gauge. The draft gauge is shown with figure 293. Use the ten metal diaphragm fastened to the flat cap and can't see leverage for bring with the atmospheric pressure. Atmospheric pressure is exerted with the top of the diaphragm on the draft at the bottom of this pressure differential cave with the diaphragm to move down. The downward movement is registered with the canty lever the for spring. The motion of the canty lever spring is transmitted through the chain with the counterbalance point of the produce. The indication from the scale with it directly proportional to the draft. The point of the point big age for the move to the end, end in an arc. The area of the diaphragm is large with greatly magnified the force of the available for the move the pointer, the glue glass, glue gas analyzer, glue glass analyzer, the variety of flue glass, um, flue gas analyzer, the variety of flue gas analyzer may be installed with the central boil plant. The purpose to allow the operator to move the more efficiently monitoring operate plant to ensure the compliance with the environmental regulations. One oxygen analyzer. The percent percentage of the oxygen oxygen in boiler fluid glass is affected with the combustion guy. With the continuous monitoring of the oxygen level can be accomplished by using the zergram oxide oxygen analyzer shown in Figure 294. Analyzers consist of the sampling system, which pulls the fluid gas to the zirconium oxide located with the electrical furnace approximately 1,700 degrees Fahrenheit. With the cell responding to the percent of the oxygen fluid gas by the generating small electrical current analyzer, the electronics evaluate the electronic current from the cell and produce the output signal with the indicator recorder with the combustion of the trim control system. Two, the carbon monoxide analyzer. The carbon monoxide analyzer flue gas indicate the incompletion of the combustion due to the either lack of the insufficient combustion or air or inter inefficient mixing of fuel or air. Modern boiler pans may be equipped with a carbon, a carbon monoxide analyzer to provide the operator with indicating how much carbon monoxide exists. Carbon monoxide of flue uh, gas is um, converted with the electronical signal by the oxidation of the catalyst converted with the element measurement of the heat produced. Analyzer 
analyze your electronics provided with the output signal proportional with the concentrate of the carbon dioxide with the single sample stream. The output is sent with the recorder, but occasionally with the trimming input with the combustion control system. Historically, reliability has been a problem with the carbon monoxide analyzers. However, the technology improved their reliability is expected to improve their use of the combustion control system, which will provide more common the carbon monoxide trimming that is applicable only to the oil gas fire boilers, which are limited essentially with the same um, criteria as those noted in the oxygen trim, uh, tr trim systems in 226D3. Three smoke density indicator the coal and oil fire plants may have provided with the smoke density indicator that records when smoke particularly objectionable. They usually consist of light source with the proto electric cell mounted with the opposite side of the stack and electrical system to contain the cell um the cell cell signal and the indicator recorded the mounted mounted on the panel. Um the the amount of sulfur dioxide and uh, nitrogen oxide um Contains may, um, monitoring pollutants sometimes required with the environmental regulation. Sulfur dioxide, oxide, nitrate, nitrogen oxides of nitrogen are pollutant most commonly required to monitor several different types of the analyzer available to monitoring pollutants. Extract of extractive men, means non dispersed non dispersive infrared ultraviolet photometric um, electrochemical analyzer for both sulfur dioxide and nitrous oxide. Chemical chemomalunescence uh, analyzer number uh, number nitrogen nitrous oxide flame photometric fluorescence 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 and fluorescence analyzer of sulfur dioxide dioxide each type of this has own advantage disadvantage technology rapid changing the detailed analysis up to date technology environmental agency requirements required for the analyzer of this type of installed. Temperature gauges. Temperature, temperature is measured by the number of devices, the most common in which with the mercury liquid um, filled with the industrial thermometer when the remote indication of the record of the temperature is needed. For example, the monitoring flue glass temperature leaving the boiler of the tube, the capillary upon pneumatic electronic sensor for the transmitter can be provided with the connection and indicator of the record. Temperature devices can be also used to provide field food, um, feed food, forward feedback signals and control system. Reference paragraph 228B, figure 295, illustrate the typical, typical recording thermometer. High recorders are very active, but the recorders are available to provide permanent record for the almost variable, which can be measured. Some records can be made be connected directly to the instrument, which provides the recording signal. This is an airflow stream flow meter shown in figure two. Uh, figure two ninety two inclined uh, inclined YouTube manometer atmospheric inclined manometer. Um, the p point of measurement in the YouTube and atmosphere. Um, Pivot, pivot bearing, B chain, pulley, spring extension, slack, leather, D gram, diaphragm, high pressure, fleet, flexing, leather, stuffing box, low pressure connection, calibration, spring pointer, and scale. 93, 293 diaphragm and a drive gauge. 294 Zincrim Oxide Oxygen Analyzer. The probe in the house of this venture is mounted directly in the stack of the in stack. Utilize the property of the zirconic oxide measuring the oxygen content. The process of the gas emitted with the protective ceramic filler with the sample side of the sensor produced the inverse logarithm of the DC voltage set and signal which is sent with the temperature control. Or you have a probe, single probe schematic drawing um, going into the temperature control, um, 100, 100 VACs at 15% of 50 to 60 Hz, 170 VA, and two in, in um, current output, two voltage outputs, a dual alarm remote system indicating transmitter. Um, from the probe, you go to the reference calibration panel with calibration gas and instrument air. The chromium ion oxide, oxide oxygen analyzer. 295 recording thermometer 296 strip chart recorder and uh 76 other than remotely mounted receiving the electronic pneumatic signal with the instrument element the typical strip chart the type of the recorder the illustrated in figure 296 of the particular mode can be recorded with three separate processes of variable, variables of four inch wide strip with other models may be recorded in the 20 variables both strip charts are circular charts but typically use the air army boiler plant plants generally recorded with two var four variables 229 water treatment control instrument and controls of water treatment system are discussed in chapter four Ch um solution section five pollution control equipment.